Okay, so last night my wife and I were talking about something. You ever not know something existed and you find out it's existed for a while and you're like, how did I not know this? It's kind of embarrassing. So in one of the rooms in our house, there's this like big picture, you know, like a oil painting type picture. It's kind of a nice room. And I go, I go, don't you wish that you could press a button and it would flip and become a TV? So you're hanging mm. in the air having a drink and it would become TV. She goes, well, they have those. I go, you mean like it flips around? She goes, no, not like the bat cave, dumb dumb. <laughs> but they have TVs that are like art or, or or can show. You guys know about this? Yeah. Yeah. I've never heard of this before. Yeah, like the screen is a piece of art, yeah. and then you turn on the TV, and then it's a TV. But it's a normal TV screen. Yeah. Yeah. So I looked it up today. I think they call them frame TVs. Really? So you know what's a funny thing? It's, it sort of speaks to possibly how observant you are. This TV is one. This is a frame TV. There's very yes, often yeah. when we sit down here, a piece of art sitting on this. There's like a. It's like a painting. It looks yeah. like, a like a Monet. Okay, so it could it could look more like a piece of art where you wouldn't necessarily know what the TV. Is. It's going to look like a TV, but instead of seeing a blank screen, it's got a piece of art on it. I didn't realize it was such an eyesore staring at a black a blank screen TV like we've done all this time. I, well, but like I, I looked at this, this site. So you can get them where they look like uh, on an easel or something like that. That's an odd TV to watch. Yeah, but like I think maybe you could flip it or something. And then these have look like wood frames on the side, so you really cannot notice that it's a TV. So you need to know. Look at this one. Whoa. That looks like a, really a painting. Yeah. Over a fireplace. I'm told that's a TV. Yeah, <laughs> you sounded like Seinfeld there. I know the TV. <laughs> imagine I imagine going to the house on a Sunday thinking you're going to watch football and you bring it all and say, what the heck? Where's the TV? Right, right. I can see me freaking out. How do you not have a TV But in that this goes house? from here to here. Yeah. I, I like this. That's a good looking room. I, yeah, that's a good looking room. And you imagine you're sitting there and you're just reading. You can get away with a couple of TV. If you said to your wife, right. let's get these, but we can have art there. Right. It's not like we have three TVs on the wall. We yeah. have three paintings. So these are frame TVs. Yeah. One of course. my favorite examples of this is about five years ago, Paul came in and was like, yeah. Have you guys heard of this Bluetooth? <laughs> <laughs> you sit in your car and turn it on and the music just automatically connects. It's like, you don't have to put in a CD. You don't have to put it. I like, was like eight years yeah, late. Welcome to like 1993. <laughs> yeah. Well, he also yeah. came in not too long ago and he goes, God. You ever listen to Tom Petty? <laughs> I go, like six years ago. Like uh, 30 years ago. Uh, yeah, damn yeah. the torpedoes. God, you guys he's heard got of this some Bluetooth? hits. <laughs> it's these, amazing. These TVs that could do art, they're brand new, right? <laughs> no, no, they're seven years old. There it is. You learned something new. I do, at least. Todd was Captain Obvious. You're not. I'm Captain Oblivious. Yeah, Captain Oblivious. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that is. Yeah. There we go.